So picking up where we left off last time. So in the last video, I went over adding music to a level. So in this one, I'll go over how to change the appearance of your level, like colors and stuff. Now before we start adding objects, you might want to change the theme. Themes decide the colors of the background, the objects, your character, and basically everything else. To change the theme, first you have to press this button, the event slash check button. This is where you can add a whole bunch of different effects to your level, like camera movement, shakiness, glowing, and theme, which I covered in my effects tutorial. Each of these effects has a starting keyframe all the way on the left, which determines how the effects will start off. You can click any of these keyframes to view and edit them. For instance, right now, the level will start off with no shakiness, no bloom, no vignette, and if I click the keyframe in the theme row, you can see that the theme that it starts off with is called machine. To change the theme, all I have to do is look in this drop down menu filled with themes. You're, you're gonna have some presets, and I have some themes that I made and other people made, but how do you make your own theme? So all you have to do to make your own theme is to scroll down to the bottom of this drop down list and press create new theme. Then after you've named it, press create new at the top here. That will create a new theme, but it doesn't automatically switch to that theme so you can edit it. So you need to scroll down until you find it and then click the little pen icon to the right. From here, you get this big menu of all the different things you can change the color of. All you have to do to change a color is click on one of the little colored boxes and set it to a color you want and press save. This box changes the color of the background. The second box changes the color of the player's trail and the color of the progress bar at the bottom of the level. These four boxes change the colors of the various players. These nine boxes right here change the colors of the different objects that you can have in your level, the obstacles. The backgrounds are these little pulses in the background that grow and shrink to the beat of the music like an equalizer. Most people call them BGs or background objects. You don't have to have these. One thing you should know that the very first color that you put in is going to be the color that all of these objects fade into. Right now, they're all fading into that one light pinkish color. So now that I've told you what each of these things do, I'm gonna make my theme for my level now. All you have to do is press update and then create new to update your theme. So that's how you change the appearance of your level. My next tutorial will cover the different buttons in the editor and their functions.